thanks to the organizers because this is a, a really very timely and very a very interesting event, uh, not only the opening, but I, I'm really looking forward uh, to also hear the conclusions of the uh, and of the debates. Um, it is I've been asked to replace uh, our commissioner, Commissioner Ander, here, because today there is the release of the country uh, recommendations, and of course he has to be there. Otherwise, he would have uh, loved to be uh, here and share some of the thoughts. And he has asked me to share some of the ideas behind the social investment package that was adopted in uh, 20th of February. But of course, a bit too early to judge on the implementation. But I fully agree with some of the feedback already given. But some of, some of it in this meeting, I hope, will help us collectively to try to implement some of the ideas in the package. It is also very timely because in June we will have a council, uh, an EBSCO council, and a council that is very, very focused on the areas that you are talking about. There will be an initiative again on youth, probably. There is also the social dimension of the MU will be discussed. There is also uh, the SIP a package uh, will have conclusions at the council level and there are the uh, country uh, recommendations that will be adopted or rejected uh, by by the council itself so this is a uh, very very timely it is also very timely because we ourselves and our staff is uh, dealing with the convention and, and the platform are here also. It is very timely from that perspective because we also are reflecting on how the, to make the platform and the convention even more efficient, more effective at, to deal with the urgency of the crisis. Uh, social here crisis and poverty crisis, but also to help ref with the more medium-term reforms. And that's where the, um, and I, I, I think uh, if, if the social investment package doesn't uh, highlight enough the role of the local uh, level, uh, I think that's, uh, that would be a mistake, but that was really uh, intended because uh, the competences of the Commission at European level are very, uh, very weak. And the, 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 the issue is really how to deal uh, how to support the local level as much as possible, and that is uh, our intention. I wanted to show a few slides um, from uh, the, the social investment package perspective, but also 2020, because indeed the, social, the strategy of 2020 is really our strategy still that is inclusive, smart and sustainable. And sometimes with the crisis being longer and deeper than we expected, in a way, we've forgotten a little bit the overall uh, focus, and I, I welcome this uh, focus very much in this conference. We also should be honest uh, in the targets. Uh, I saw some of the questions in, in, in the preparatory work. Should we change the targets? When we don't reach the targets, uh, I find that quite a, a, ch a strange uh, conclusion in a way, and I hope the conference will uh, really help raise the ambition again. Be but for the moment, the reality is that the two targets that we are in DG Employment and our commissioner are specifically focusing on and in charge of basically the poverty target and employment target are, of course, off track. Uh, we uh, we are not reaching uh, what we uh, said ourselves to reach collectively. <coughs> Can I have the next, please? I'm sorry, I cannot control the 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 target on poverty. You can see here, first of all, very valuable for you also the the the, the large variation of poverty and at risk for social po uh, social exclusion <coughs> differ very much from country to country. Um, what is also uh, clear in that, in, in that slide is uh, where the level of ambition of the member states are. The member states were supposed to set their own targets and some of the member states set the target so nicely that they have reached that target already. But sadly, there are quite a lot of poor people still increasing in these countries. So there is an issue of level of ambition by some of the member states or level of taking this target serious. 
Um, next, please. Uh, the employment target, as some of the speakers already mentioned, the unemployment is, of course, the blue line is where we put our, collectively our level of ambition, because this was not the Commission, this was also at the Council level. Okay, So all of the member states set that level of ambition. But when they ch change this into national targets, we only reach the, the red level. So already there is a lowering of ambition, so it's the others that have to solve the, the unemployment target, not the countries themselves. But then when you look at the uh, green line where we are for the moment, and of course in some of, some of the countries this is even worse, but this is, a, uh, this is showing uh, the, the level for all of the uh, member states together, uh, it is uh, a flat line and in some countries it is a, a downwards spiral. Yes. So the next slide, please, uh, is a very complex slide, but I only want to use this to say that the crisis basically, uh, no, I want to say this basically because social, social policies are supposed to do three things. They are supposed to protect people against risks of unemployment, sickness, and so on. And we should be proud in Europe that we invented a social welfare state in different forms in different countries that was dealing with uh, protecting people against risks. Second role of social policies is also to invest in people so that we can prevent risks as much as possible, of course. And the third role is stabilizing um, the household's incomes and the economy. And there is where this slide shows that basically the stabilizing effect worked for a while and is now so much under stress because the crisis took too long and um, the, the social policies have not really adapted well enough uh, that people are dependent now again on labor incomes that are not there sometimes or quite often. Yes, next please. So the social investment package itself is uh, focusing on these three areas, but we wanted to call it social investment because very often, and I'm happy to hear that more and more people use the term of uh, social investment, because we should not see social policies only as a cut to <coughs> invest in in good times and cut in bad times. I think it's basically the opposite that should happen. Uh, and in the short term, we need to protect people, but in the long term, we need to continue investing in people so the increasing levels of child poverty cannot be right in the long term. Because this, show, this slide, I like this slide, because it shows basically that the earlier you invest the, uh, in children, even before three years old, the better your results are when they are 15 years old. The, the large uh, blue bar uh, basically shows you that. But as my uh, right-hand uh, colleague here uh, said, we, the social investment package goes into investing a long life course from child to active aging to long-term care if needed. So there is a, there is a whole uh, action in the social investment package for across the life uh, course of people. Here it shows, this slide shows how countries do very differently also in providing a formal childcare so that that would be good for children in themselves, of course, but also it helps women uh, in employment. Denmark, you see totally on the right side, but you see also countries like Hungary, Malta, uh, totally on the bottom line there, um, questioning really um, how to increase the participation of women in the labor market, and we will need and we are needing more women in the labor market, even if we don't have enough uh, work uh, and employ for the moment. Um, it is important that women are included more and more, if for themselves, for the children, but also uh, for uh, not to end up in um, in poverty in older age. And we see in some of the countries, for example, with uh, quite an extensive uh, social policy, uh, good economy, growth, 
even in countries such as Sweden, we, ha we see an increase in poverty among older age women. Yes, next, please. The second strand for the social investment package says basically that we should be uh, working on activating and enabling uh, people to uh, and benefits and services at different levels. Again, you see that Denmark and, and Belgium are at the la same level of investment in activating and enabling benefits and services, and they have a little bit of a different outcome of in their uh, result of. Um, of stopping long-term unemployment mm, at the left side. But you see, again, a variation across uh, the line, across uh, different countries. And I think it's important also for people working in different regions and responsible in different regions to see where uh, specific actions should be placed. I have no time to go into the details here now, but uh, this can be discussed in further details if need be. Next, please. The last trend on the social investment package basically says that, uh, of course, it is important to invest the right uh, uh, amount of resources uh, to invest, protect and stabilize. And again, you have a range of countries at the right side here. Um, but you also have in the same line of, of resource allocation, you have also a different level of efficiency uh, or results. In the, when measured in, uh, in terms of uh, reduction of poverty at the left side. So again there, when you look at the line between Austria, Luxembourg, Spain and, and Greece, there is uh, of course also details to be taken into account that can vary a little bit, but uh, I think Spain, for example, doesn't have uh, the pension uh, calculated properly there. But uh, still, there is there's a range of things that can be taken into account that are important. Yes, next, please. Um, I, want, uh, I don't want to go into this. We can stop this. Uh, I know that I have to keep my time. For implementation, and I think the, 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 the implementation is now at the core of our in, in interest. Implementation, we have uh, the semester, partly the semester, we have policies, we have support systems, we have funds, and more and more uh, our colleagues from Regio are sitting here in the room. We're working closely together on, uh, w on making the best uh, efforts in using the funds. And on the um, platform and the convention, we are, as we said, as I said in the beginning, com thinking about how to make this even uh, better. Also, the governance issues are a discussion in the social committee and in the commission itself also. So your su suggestions and your inputs are uh, very timely on all of this. Thank you.